Leaky tub and shower faucets are not on our list of favorite things, but they're simple to fix yourself. To get started, you'll need the following tools. An Allen wrench, wrench, pliers, needle nose pliers, screwdriver, and a cleaner to remove mineral buildup. Turn off the main water supply to your home. For knob style handles, remove the index button by prying off with the screwdriver, then unscrew the handle screw and remove the handle. For lever handles, remove the set screw with a screwdriver or Allen wrench and then remove the handle. Loosen the cam nut to reveal the plastic cam and ball assembly. The cam nut is a dome-shaped piece below the handle. Turn the cam nut counterclockwise to remove. Lift out the plastic cam and cam gasket to expose the ball and remove the ball from the faucet. Before installing the new parts, remove the ball from the faucet assembly by lifting out. Look back into where the ball came from. There should be two rubber seats and springs. Use needle nose pliers to remove them. Thoroughly clean the inside of the faucet body with cleaner intended to remove mineral buildup or use plain vinegar. Once you've purchased your new ball assembly, you can install it into the faucet. Start with installing the seats and springs first. Insert the spring wide end first, then place the rubber seat over the narrow end of the spring. Tip, you may find it easier to assemble the seat and spring outside of the faucet and then place onto the tip of a screwdriver and insert them into the faucet body. Place the ball back into the faucet assembly. The ball may have a notch that fits a small peg inside the faucet. Align the peg and notch on the ball assembly to ensure proper installation into the faucet. Install the replacement gasket cam and plastic cam over the top of the ball. Place the cam nut over the plastic cam and then tighten. Slide the handle onto the stem or handle adapter. Do not use handle screws at this point. Turn the water supply back on and test for leaks and ensure the hot water temperature is adequate. If there are leaks or if the handle is too hard to move, adjust the adjustment ring inside the cam nut, the brass or plastic ring with two notches on the top of it. Be sure not to exceed the maximum temperature allowed by local plumbing code. And finally, secure the handle with the set screw and your project is complete.